Hi, fellow detectives, TEDx aficionados, and everybody who managed to come through the clutches of Delhi traffic and managed to be here today. I am somebody you must have seen either in movies or serials like Sherlock Holmes. Today, I am here not wearing a black overcoat and a hat. Rather, I am here to break the stereotypes these movies have built for detectives. Hello, I am Dr. Akriti Khatri, but I am not your average detective. Because I not only see every case with a magnifying glass, but I also add on a very special element to it called as empathy. Empathy is knowing and understanding the human side of the stories, which is as important as evaluating an evidence. It also says that every criminal is human too. At the beginning of my career, even my co-workers did not connect with me the way I work. They always used to think how empathy can fit into the puzzle of investigations. Trust was a rare commodity in the office. But I was fortunate that my clients trusted me a lot because I never treated them as merely case files. I always treated them as humans who have stories, struggles and emotions. Today, I'm here because of this topic called as empathy, which is my secret weapon. And I am able to build my company called as Venus Consulting Solutions Private Limited. Now, let me tell you a work story from my work life. Once I was working on a pre-marriage case. I'm supposed to visit the residence of my subject as my clients require a deeper investigation of the subject and family. Getting the work done is not easy. It's an art. And its core lies in the fact that the connection between people. So that lady who opened the door, I started interacting with her. So after a small empathetic interaction, she let me come inside her home. I went inside her home, appreciated her home, interiors and paintings. While I was interacting, I observed an inhaler lying out there. An inhaler which is mostly used by the patients who are suffering from asthma. Hence, a small empathetic conversation led to a subtle clue which gives volume about the case I was working upon. The qualities of a detective is to be a good listener and be a very good observer too. Being normal, being confident, synchronizing your body language with facial expressions are some of the non-negotiable aspects of a detective's life. To be a good detective, you need to have good listening skills, observation along with that. You need to blend with the surrounding. One need to be a very good adaptable person. In an area which belongs to some rich and high profile people where people drive luxury cars, if I dress up like a normal person and be there and try to investigate, 
then that won't facilitate any conversation between us. I need to be looked like that somebody who is a part of them. They should correlate to. I should adapt to the surroundings. So these things helped me a lot. While I was expanding my company, then I took this empathy beyond solving the cases. It helps us and our team to glue and gel together. Trust and understanding helped my team to bond and take the company to the next level. That is why today I am having multiple offices across the country and more than 85 people of staff including freelancers and salaried people. In a workplace, empathy is the secret sauce. When the meeting looks like longer than even a Monday. So, while doing a meeting, any of your colleague suggests an idea which is as questionable as a pineapple topping on a pizza, then don't dismiss it. Rather, empathize with it. Now, let me take you to an, another work example of mine. One day, I was partying with my friends and few of my clients reached office and they wanted to have a rush-rush meeting as I was not dressed formally. Somebody who could be at my place may be feeling apologetic or uncomfortable how to face a client in this informal dress. But I was not. I quickly told my clients that, you know, I was on a project. That is why I am dressed like this. This made my clients, instead of feeling uncomfortable, a connection or a bond with me. So I realized a pinch of empathy can take these meetings up to a different level where the formal meetings miss out. It's few things. Empathy is not just a tool. Empathy is the way of life. That is why to blend with surroundings, to adapt with the surrounding and when life throws unexpected lessons to you, then one should behave and react in a way that every conversation, every interaction should be empathetic and connected with the people. In conclusion, I would like to say empathy is the tool of life, but I believe for me as a detective, it is the philosophy of life where you can connect with people, trust, understanding, all these things are a kind of fabric which is woven with the thread of empathy. So try to weave empathy not only into your professional fabric, but also into the every aspect's life throws at you. So whether you are chasing a suspect or you are catching a last local back home, a little bit of empathy takes a long way. Thank you.